Deleted. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So today we're going to be starting the solo queue to champion this season for Operation Deep Freeze. I know you've been seeing some pre-recorded gameplay. That was from last season. Some full matches I did at the end of uh, Heavy Metal. I think that's what it was called. Those are some really good games. So I did hope you enjoyed those. I believe that's all the footage I have now. So we're going to be going into the new season finally. We're going to be getting some new operators in the lineups um as you can see here these are the ops i have right now on this account i do have a bit more i have fenrir i have solace um, i don't have solace i mean a zombie i have ace i have yana so we do have quite a bit of operators to choose from that is good i'm going to keep getting more as the season continues too oh just found a game perfect timing and we'll see what map we'll be playing today but yeah, hopefully I can get all the operators by the end of the season. I might buy a couple, including the new ops, so I can use them for you. So we'll see. Definitely going to ban Emerald. It seems like I always ban Emerald planes. I swear it's always in the rotation, but maybe that's just me. All the rest of the maps are fine. So we got Consult, okay. Villa was there too. Apparently these are the only two maps I can play. I don't know what that's about. The other team banned the Yingao. I don't blame them for that. I'm going to go for the Jackal, because I do want to run Dokubi. I feel like Dokubi is good on uh, solo queue, especially for this map. It's still like a newer map, kind of. I don't know why I keep saying I'm talking the game. It's weird. I am trying out a new controller. Um, in the last couple videos, probably you've seen I was using the default, because my other one broke. I had a Power A Spectre controller, but the triggers just completely gave out on me, so I had to get a new one. I think it's a different addition because it doesn't have the volume button in the middle, but I'm not really positive on that. I guess we'll see. Um, I'm not feeling the best on it so far, but I only just got it tonight. I played a few of the little map runs. I did make a video on how to warm up, so go check that out. But we will see how this goes. I feel like there's already some stick drift on this one too. Not good. Like it's easier to go upright, or up, <laughs> not upright. It's easier to go up than it is to go down right now on the right stick. I'm not liking that. Uh, I'm back on the 12 five dead zones instead of five three. Because these sticks are way more sensitive, I feel like. They have less give. Or more give, that would be. I'm not a fan of that, though. I kind of like the default controller sticks now that I have been using them. The other power I control I was using felt good, though, so I'm not sure. I guess it just varies controller to controller. We'll see how this is, though. I just wanted to get some gameplay finally for you guys for the new season. Start this journey. My goal is to play 200 matches, so we'll see if we can get that. I know that might not seem like much to some of you guys, but I haven't played 200 ranked games in a season since, like, literally year three or four, I think. I honestly don't play this game too much. Oh, hello there. Is she coming back up? I don't think so. She gave up. Um, yeah, I really don't play too much ranked. But I do for these videos, and I do want to play more this time around. Okay, we're getting in here 3v3. I don't think they have any cams on me. I hear somebody. One is right next to me. Okay, that guy's lost. He had no idea I was here. My aim felt way off right there. Again, it might take me a second. Oh, last guy's right here. Oh, I think you push to the right. They have diffuser, don't they? Did this guy just run away? I'll take that then and go plant. 
Ooh, that was scary. I don't know why our teammate was trying to challenge him down there. No need for that. Ash is literally full sprinting down here. Oh my god. That's actually an OG skin, so that guy's been playing for a long time, but... I uh, don't know what that challenge attempt was. We just had to plant the bomb. But alright. Got the job done, at least. Again, I don't really know what ranks we're playing in here for this, because... I just started. This is the first time this account's ever played ranked. I've just used this one for some quick matches to get up to level 54 this season. I did that a little bit last season. So we've never played before. We should be around like gold or platinum hidden matchmaking, I, I think. Seems like that is what they would start us at. I'm going to play like I always would though. There's no need to play uh, differently if you know you're playing lower ranks. You should always play like you're playing the best people in the game. That's a good mindset to have. It's good to start doing the strategies that you do in the higher level. Even if you're in, like, copper, for example. Just a good word of advice there. Yeah, the guy on our team, the Ash, has the, uh... Can't even hit a default cam. They have the skin from the theme park season. Shoot that off for ghost pressure and make it look like somebody's actually coming here. So I blow the Aruni. I go in here again. I feel like this is a good place to entry from. They won't just sit at this door usually. I only show that default cam so they don't see me walking away if they happen to get on it with siege timing right when I'm walking away from it. This guy just rappelled down the sky. That's crazy. Let me call. I'm going to drone form. This is my drone is pre-placed right here. Also, make sure to pre-place your drones when you're so lucky. It's huge. I shoot this yokai dude. Oh, I'm not dead somehow. That was almost bad. That guy peaked there the worst time. I'm gonna try to flank him here. I'm literally just sprinting towards yellow, thinking he's gonna come this way. Hear him above me. He might try to flank me. Look at that. I was perfect on it. I knew he was gonna do that. Monkey man. Another one top yellow. Get that trade. Don't know where you're going. Echo seems good. He's mowing down my team every round. Oh, he's really mowing them down. Just missed that dude. Well, that guy's horrible. Why is he swinging that? That was crazy play. Where's this guy to be hiding at now? Maybe I can just plant here. I don't have much health for this. I tried to pre-fire, but he was already pre-firing. That was a good play to push me there. A lot of people would play really scared and get far back and let the plant happen. That was a good play from this guy. Yeah, he has a plat charm, so we're playing at least in that kind of rank. So if this, uh, if you guys are in platinum or gold or whatever, then this will be the video for you. You can see exactly um, how to try to win against these ranks. I don't know if I'm going to win, but we'll try our best. That'd be unfortunate if we lost our first game, but we're doing fine here, attack, and we got a round already. If we can get this one, that's huge. Okay, so they're going to be in garage. So I'm bringing the buck. Got to try to get into that little tunnel. I don't know what it's called, really. Is it called electrical? I don't think so. I'll see. A lot of people call it dirt tunnel because it kind of works like a dirt tunnel does on Clubhouse. It's like it's own little back thing with a reinforcement.
Of course, there's a mozzie right here. I was trying to get a good pre-placed drone for myself. There is a roll going you can get if you go up there on that rack, but... We got caught, that's gonna make it a little harder. Oh, if I had to switch to hard bridge too, so... Hopefully I don't reinforce that wall, that would suck. I did the same kind of thing in my last video, but you can actually shoot this hatch from this door right here. If I can get to it. I'm pressing all the wrong buttons still. Since I just got this controller now, I'm using the back left button to crouch again like I was before. But like the last week, I've been using the standard controller, so I've been using RB. And now my gadget's RB again. It's all confusing, but we'll get back to it. Throwing this out. It's not reinforced. Oh. That guy's lost. Monkey man again. Got revenge for my drone. I don't know what he's doing there. Probably should reinforce that wall if you're going to sit there. Maybe they ran out, but I don't know why he'd play there if they ran out of reinforcements and there's a drone hole. Not the best game since. Don't do what that guy did. Rainsy got another one. Not ideal. Turn this out, make sure it's clear. We should be able to get the breach. We have a Cali and a Thermite. I don't know if my teammate's getting it or not, though. Opening that hatch right there, too, at the front door allows me to get better pressure in the hall because now they can't really sit under it. So now that'll be clear. I'm not seeing much of anything. It didn't extend very far. It makes it easier for me, though. Nice pick. My timing was almost terrible right there, but it's okay. I'm better. They have no rotate into that room either. One's prone? Or down? They're picking them up? I think. Last one ran here. Oh my god. I did not know he was behind me here. Why were they both in this corner? I just got wall banged before I could wall bang him. Oh no. Can the yawn and do it? Knows where he is. Oh, Caesar. Oh my god. Oh my god. Leaning all the wrong ways, but somehow won. Jeez. I don't know what I just witnessed, but we'll take that round. We will gladly take it. So they did get the breach open and got in. That was good. Uh, that's on me there. I shouldn't have pushed up that far. I thought the last one went to the right. Because I didn't expect them to just stack on each other like that. That was very strange. But I guess they did just do a revive, maybe? I'm not sure if they revived or not. I think they did. I heard someone proning. Maybe they were trying to prone to get over there in safety. But I think they were reviving. I should have just pushed faster now that I think about it. For some reason, I was thinking there were three alive, and then I noticed there was two once I had killed the two brew. I wanted that last one. It's okay, though. We got the round. Teammate clutched. 2-1 attack. That's really good. Just got to get our D. I'm bringing the mute here. I'll show you guys a really good setup on this. Make head holes here to watch the breach. Reinforce this one for cover. I do this every time, basically. Make shotgun holes here. I feel like this is good because now you can challenge from the left side of this uh, reinforcement and then the right side because of the door. They have to worry about both sides. The main breach. I'll show you a good mute jammer for this. Better than the usual that you can just put on the ground here. Put it right here on this table. I did this in my last video too if you were watching, but that way it's vertical. It goes way higher up, so it's harder for them to breach it vertically. They have like an ace and they try to counter mute by putting it high. I like this Azami, I'll put a jammer on that. <laughs> that drone just gave its life to me, okay. Gotta set this up too. Teammates not really setting much up, so I gotta do everything, I guess. The usual though, when you're solo queuing. Gotta try to find that right balance. Don't wanna over set up and just die. Cause you get rushed. You barricade this for that reason. I'm gonna try to play over here by the reception area. 
That chair survived that shotgun blast. It's crazy. Still pressing the wrong buttons. And I'll put another one right here behind the vending machine. Now this mutes the entire hallway, basically. Circle right there. Flipping cams there really quick. If you're on site, you should probably flip cams when you can. Even in solo queue, if you can get some yellow pings or red pings, it'll help. Good first pick. Somebody's going to try to push that stairway down here. Visa. Well, Mai's watching it. Well, Mai dead. Try to get this trade. Oh, I just missed. There we go. I'm being shot from below? What is this guy doing? He's just holding a hole? Who even made this hole? What is that? Why is this guy just sitting under this? I mean, I guess he was going for the trade with the ram, but like, why was she so far back still in the hall? She wasn't even trying to trade. She was just watching a random hole that I went into. That's unlucky. I didn't know that hole was there. Oh no, we're going to lose this one. That was a 3v2. I'm kind of dumbfounded right now. I don't know what I just died to. Oh, jeez. Finrir. Now, if I'm not mistaken... Okay, never mind. Finrir did put his gadgets down. He didn't put his bulletproof down, but that's okay. He said three out of three and two or something, so I thought he didn't put a single Finrir down, but he did have one, at least. This guy's carrying them. It's Osa. I mean, that round was just luck. I don't know why she was under that hole, but... And we just kind of threw after that. We should have won that one. It's okay, though. I think we should just go back here. Somebody's voting server intellers. That's not the site you want to go. The split site. I'm just going to do the same mute thing. I feel like we were doing good there. We just kind of fell apart. We won't garage, too. Okay, never mind. We're good. Yeah, we kind of just threw that one. Just very lost in why Osa was holding that hole. Who, who even made that hole? Was that Wamai that did that? Why was that there? If you're going to make that hole, you got to hold it. Couldn't have been like a grenade from below anymore. We're in the new season now, baby. Same thing as last run here, just do all the setup for the team. Grab this drone. There we go. This is a very long setup. That's why I don't play mute too much in solo queue. You have way too much to do. Because I just want to make every hole in sight for the team, but then I also had to put four mute jammers down, so it takes a while. And then I'll get stuck and can't even place it. I don't even know if they went for the breach or not. Maybe I shouldn't have gotten mute. This rank, I think I'm just trying to do too much because my team doesn't really help me with the setup and there's insight. Or below random holes, I guess. But I have time to get my jammers down over here. This is a real rass spot to play right here behind the vending machine, too. I've seen a lot of pro players doing that in the Last major. Good power spot. Oh, nice. That's Rainsy dead. That's their carry. Yeah, here it is. Nine kills. My quick picks feel off right now on this controller. I'm not going to lie. I'm not trying to make excuses, but I'm just feeling slow right now on this. I feel out of control. I feel flicky, though. Hey there. You gotta shoot your defaults, buddy. I think that's RAM, maybe. Man, I wish I was downstairs. I don't know if anybody is down there ratting again, probably, so I'm not gonna risk it and go down there. Yeah, somebody's died downstairs. If I could have got to that window, I could have got a freebie on that guy droning. Really gotta shoot your defaults. 
Where is he drowning? That's the question. About to filing go in. Team's just dead again. Meek meal. I'm gonna shoot that and then get my rash spot like I was just saying. Now they think I'm over by the doorway. Hopefully this guy's good inside though. I don't know what they're really pushing. This, these guys are slower than I expected. I haven't heard a peep. Yeah, Mozzie's over there. There's that ram. Deleted. He's running. You know what? I'm chasing him. He go yellow. I don't think he went yellow. I don't know where that guy just ran the ace. That guy is scared for his life. Don't be like that guy. You want to actually try to win the round, not just full sprint run away. Even if it's a 1v3, you can hit some crazy shots if they start peeking you. Like, me and the Mozzie were right there stacked up, and Doc was right there, too. You can't just full sprint away like that. I think it's time. I was mentioning this in the last console video, so if you guys were watching, you already know what I'm doing. I'm trying to pull out the castle room set up upstairs. I feel like I can get a lot done with this in solo queue. They always go above, so I think I can waste a lot of time, then I can drop back to site. And hopefully kill, like, a fuse or... A ram or something, so we can really hold vertical down better. Last time I played the site on video, I got fused, cluster charged, and down from it, because it was so instant when I was impact tricking. And it cost the game. Me and Rainsy are battling it out right now at 9 kills apiece. So make these holes so you can see from the hatch. Pop that before our team reinforces. that and I'll get out of here. I got a lot to do upstairs so you got to go right away pretty much. I just wanted to make- oh my god I'm doing it again. I just wanted to make those holes so nobody would reinforce that. So you want to reinforce the single wall right here on piano next to the castle. Put that prox in the window in case they jump in and they make holes. I'm gonna run over here and do these castles first before I make the rotate. You wanna castle the lounge door? I like castling this and then the other lounge door. So it gets two layers. They have to break these before they break my other one here. I'll show you. Both foes. I mean your last castle goes right here on this door. Wait, let me put the procs too. So now I'll know right when they're at the door. I already hear somebody sprinting. Let me make the rotate too here. Is there one in? Maybe I can make the rotate, I guess. They're on me. Somebody just walked through there. So now I got an assist on somebody. Got the old double good night right there on those guys. 5v2, we got this. We literally just gotta chill now, we win. I'm just, I'm just gonna pro in this corner. Is Mozzie up here? He died. I looked away for one second because the mozzie died up here and I was trying to see where because they could have been in behind me too if they opened that castle or the hatch. Oh my god, it's 2v2.
if we're dying from the hatch, my team are just bots, because I opened that in the prep phase, like, at the very beginning. We got another that's open already. Man, me and Mozzie were holding that down, too. We had 5v2. Dropped. Got default cam on this guy, too. I'm going to red ping him and make him lose his mind. Oh my god, a nook, of course. We can't even see her. There's no way this is going OT. I'm upset too there that I was uh, um, looking away for just a split second when the Osa put her head through. That was a good shot from her too. She knew right where I was. She has good aim, that's for sure. Me and her are literally having like a 1v1. At least we got defense. I mean, no. Attack was 2-1 each side, so it's not a good thing we got defense now that I think about it. This has been an uh, attacker favored game. I'm not going mute. Like I said, somebody already took him anyways. No, I'm going to hop on a Fenrir. Yeah, I'm going to hop on the Fenrir here. I forgot I have him on this account now, so that's going to be fun to use him. I didn't have him on the solo queue account last season. And he is the best solo queue operator, I think. He can do everything. Make holes with the shotgun. Five traps, and I have two barb. Really good gun, too, of course. Same setup here, I can do it with him, too. Just a lot of lines of sight, basically. Also, that last round, I mean... It was timing that I died, but I also could have just played safe, or I should have just chilled in that corner. I don't know why I was prone peeking it. That was dumb, especially when I wasn't even paying attention. I gotta focus on that angle if I'm gonna play it. That's a good Fenry right there. I took my eyes off of it for one second, and I died to it. I should have just crashed in that corner. Activate that, we don't have to barricade it that way. Do this wall, we should be good. Got one more trap to put down. I'm basically just putting traps everywhere here. I'm going to activate the ones that I think the enemies are going to push first. Got one for one, that's okay. Break the glass so you can hear the repel. Put one right here on this door for in case they rush through the skylight or something. I don't think they come big window, or like the main window. Everybody's just dead again, 3, 4, right off the rip. Nobody's really holding yellow, so I'll hold it, I guess. I wanted to put this bar down, but I didn't have time to. Fenry does have a lot to do, like, mute in the prep phase. I'm just going to put it right here, so in case they get to that door later, I'll have something to stop them. So I don't think I'm going to have my team to rely on here. Oh, never mind. I'll eat my words. I'll set my back, so I'm going to hold this. Nice, Valk. I seen Valk getting aggressive, those are right there, so I wanted to help her play the 2v1. Just in case she died, I could have got that tread on the ram. And spiral. I broke it. Probably the Nook, right? Again, I'm going to try to play off contact here with the Valk. Now they're yellow. Mute is so lost. Man, I just looked away again. Get it for a second. 2v2. He's got to play time here. Good pick. It's just the book. Oh my god. I almost got timing again, but I deleted that guy. Right off the earth. Like the timing right there. You can see I was literally just looking away when he peeks. 
This isn't the best match for me in timing and whatever. Maybe it's the controller throwing me off. I feel like I'm just not focusing very well, though, so that's on me. Me and this Rangy, though, are still just going at it. We have 25 kills combined. Damn. I'm picking the Doka B again. That was working pretty well, I'd say, in the attack half since we got 2-1. So I'll keep doing that. No need to fix it. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. That was pretty much just a 1v1 with that buck there because that mute was so lost. That dude was like looking at the walls behind him when the buck already was hitting the fender trap multiple times over there. And I, I was already shooting at him and he was shooting at me. That was interesting, but it's okay. Again, I don't know what rank I'm playing at. I'm guessing gold flat is where I'm going to start here. Just looking at the charms and stuff. I try not to worry about that too much. Again, I try to play the same against everybody. Let's go Meek Meal. Found the bomb. Obviously, they're going to be upstairs here. I'm going to get a pre-place because this is where that thorn was trying to peek me from last time. So... If that drone's still up, I know it's clear when I get on it. And if they shoot it, I know there's probably somebody down there. What is this strat? They have like four people right there and they have a shield of the window. That was weird. We have the big blitz here coming out. Let's see how that's going to work. Again, I'm going to shoot all this for Ghost Brusher. Even if we're not actually pushing it. You know what? I'm not going to waste my call yet. I'm going to save them. I should drone this for a few seconds and save it that way. I feel like that's way more efficient. Don't need to be lazy. We're an OT, baby. See, that's why you shoot a cam right away. That time I was going to try to leave it up. And, of course, they get on it right at the same time. Perfect lesson on that. So just shoot him. You might as well. Unless you're Nook. Maybe I'll go Nook for this sometime. Bon has already got spoiled control. I, I feel like she repelled again. She did last time, too. That's crazy. Don't do what she's doing. Don't repel there. Ash repelled too. Oh my god. What is my team? That's the question. Blitz down. Blitz down. They're up spiral. I'm just going to drone them behind yellow. I think this is where I'm going to try to push from again. I like going spiral, but the whole team is, it seems like, so I'm going to switch it up. Good to put pressure on multiple things. We also left the diffuser in spawn, I just seen. There's no time for me to run and get it. We just got to go for kills at this point. So we threw the round. That's good. We're in copper. To trade this lion. If he pushes. Oh, <laughs> I don't know how he's alive after that. Oh, I just got pre-fired off the earth. Okay. Tagged him. Zav. That was a good pre-fire right there. This guy's not too bad either, just going off of that. Let's hit the shot of his life on me. I was in a stun too, but then he... And then the line just got down, so I had to uh, try to fight it. I was not ready for that. The play from Omai, though. My team's kind of got dumped as well at the start. That was a 3v5. I don't know who left the diffuser and spawned though. That was a throw. Probably the dudes that are just repelling down the spiral skylight, let's be honest. We got defense, though. I feel like that's a good thing, even if it's been very attacker favor this game. Make sure my loadout's good here on the Cade. I do like the Cade shotgun a lot. I swapped to Cade, too, because we don't have any wall denial, really. We have a mute, but... I don't feel like that's good enough. I'm not going to run the castle setup again. That's like a one-off thing. You shouldn't be doing that every defense round during the same match. Because they will catch on to it and they would have countered it good. I'm going to try to stop the wall and the hatch from being breached this time. 
And I'll show you guys how to set all this up now since I'm down here. Basically a lot of head holes and rotates. You do this to help hold both sights from each other. Let me get the hatch. Get a free drone on the way too. Yeah, I know. Reinforcing it. Oh, I gotta make a run for it. That was open. It bored me out. I do like this barricade. You can get really good angles from underneath it. Start putting a breach on that. I guess they faked it. I'll just keep my other cave for now. Nobody made the rotate. Or that rotate. I guess we'll just not have a rotate in there. They're not getting my cade. I like playing around this pillar right here. How was Mute already dead? I thought he was on sight. I would hold that, but there's two sides I gotta worry about, so it's kinda impossible. You know what, I'm gonna put a Kate on the hatch, then I'm gonna hold the back side. In case they get that later. Pumped out of the sky right there. That's the fuser. I'm just gonna chill. Again, we gotta play time. Not throw another round. Oh, I hear one. Oh my god, good shot, monkey man. I thought I could have got him on the peeker's advantage. I didn't want to sit in the corner if he knew I was there. Last one's back there. Oh my god, the Valkyrie was scaring me right there. Looking in the wrong spots, but she got him. Okay, team, let's go. We got the win. That's all that matters. I know I was saying we gotta play time, but I did hear the Capitao start walking up, so I wanted to take the Peeker's advantage on that gunfight and swing him, but he had a really good shot. He must have been holding, like, right on my head. I died right away. I thought I could have got him in time. I was aiming too low. My aim did feel a little bit off. I don't think I played the best in that game, really. I know I have 14 kills, but I don't think I played the best. I don't think I played to, like, my standards. But that's all right. We got the win. That's all that matters. Everybody has off games. I don't know how I'm feeling about this controller, either. That'll probably be the only match I play tonight. I got to try to get back into this one. We got 107 RP, by the way, to start. Obviously, it's a little bit lower than we beginning the last season on my hidden matchmaking champ account. Because, obviously, the matchmaking with the ranks. Those guys were like golds or plats, I feel like. Get that booster up. But yeah, good match to start the season, though. Bunch of kills. Bunch of action for you guys. I feel like I gave a lot of helpful tips on console again, too. I know we played that recently and Villa twice recently. Those are like the only two maps we can get, I guess. But hopefully the next game something different. If you did enjoy, leave a like down there below. Subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.